Hi everyone, welcome to Focal Academy. Uh, series from now. Here, three components are given. That is resistor, capacitor, and inductor, which are in parallel to each other. So that was connected to the source. That is voltage source. That is given as 10 sine of omega h. Now, how can you find result frequency, quality factor, and bandwidth for parallel RF circuit? This is the problem. In the first step, we are going to find the result frequency. That is omega naught. So omega naught equal to 1 by root of LC. This is the formula. Now substitute the L value and C value. So here L means inductor, C means capacitor, R means resistor. Now substitute the values. Then we get 1 by root of L is 0 0.2 milliampere. Milli means 10 power minus 3. And capacitance is 8 microfarad. So 8 into micro means 10 power minus 8. So it becomes 1 by root of 0 0.28 nothing but 1.6 into 10 power minus 3 into 10 power minus 6 nothing but 10 power minus 9. So by simplifying it we get 25 kilo radians per second. So this is the result frequency but it was in angular. That's why the square roots of radians per second. Now we are going to find quality factor. So quality factor depends upon the resistance frequency. So that is quality factor Q thus be equal to resistance by omega naught into L. So this is another formula for finding quality factor. Now substitute the values here. So R means resistance that is 8 kilo ohms. So 8 into kilo means 10 power 3 upon omega naught we got 25 kilo radians. That is 25 kilo means 10 power 3 and L that is given as 0 0.3 million rate. 0.2 milli means 10 power minus 3. So here 10 power 3, 10 power 3 will cancel and uh, reduce 8 by 25 to 0 0.2, nothing but 5. So 5 into 10 power minus 3. So it becomes 8 by 5, nothing but 1.6. So bring this to the numerator, it becomes 10 cube. That's cube. That's equal to 600. This is the quality factor. Now we got resistance frequency and quality factor. Now final one is bandwidth. So what is bandwidth? So bandwidth is depends upon resistance frequency and quality factor. Simply we can say that the ratio between resistance frequency to the quality factor is used bandwidth. So that is bandwidth thus equal to ratio of resistance frequency to the quality factor. Means how much resistance frequency is there per unit quality factor that is called as bandwidth. Now substitute the two values here. It becomes 25 kilo means 10 cube. So I am taking quality factor in terms of k for this equation. That will be 1.6 into 10 cube. Kilo will cancel. So by simplifying this, we will catch 15.625 units are radians per second. So this is the bandwidth and this is the quality factor and this is the resonant frequency of given parallel current circuit and this is the process of calculation of frequency, quality factor and bandwidth. Still if you have any doubts please comment. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, share, thanks.